rights to demonstrate are enshrined in the Constitution. But the Kamukunji meeting is a consultative meeting, and we want to make it very clear that the rights granted by our Constitution cannot be derogated by anyone, not the courts and not any other authority, and must be respected. The meeting will be a coming together of Kenyans to share views on the state of affairs in the country. The meeting is in line with Article 37 of the Constitution on the right to assemble, right to demonstrate, picket, and to petition. Under this article, every person has the right to peaceably and unarmed to assemble, to demonstrate, to picket, and present petitions to public authorities. This is what we will be doing on the 7th. We will be assembling, as granted by the Constitution, peacefully, in an orderly man manner, and we have appealed to those attending our meeting to be orderly and peaceful. We are dismayed that those in authority are trying to paint a horror movie. Some of them have even hoped that there will be no deaths. A clear indication that they are the ones planning mayhem. We have just come from campaigns that were so peaceful, there were no serious ugly incidents throughout the country. Where on earth would they get the idea that a public meeting will be unruly? We want to warn anybody bent on trying to disorganize and create mayhem at our meeting to be warned. And for those in charge of the security agencies to do their duty to ensure that they keep peace at our meeting as provided by the Constitution and the law. Our public consultations will be about the poor IBC commissioners who have been subjected to gross injustices and forced to resign. The consultations are also about other pressing national issues. On the IABC, we note it is being cannibalized, the consequences of which shall be grim. We are gathering to discuss this state of affairs and to remind those in authority that all legislation relating to elections in this country is normally negotiated. The law they are trying to amend was negotiated in 2017. Similarly, all laws relating to elections and to IABC must be negotiated, and we shall not tolerate skewed legislation, partisan legislation, trying to introduce a William Ruto Electoral Commission, not even a Kenya Kwanza, a William Ruto Electoral Commission. The Electoral Commission must be for all Kenyans, not to serve an individual or a faction. An area of grim concern to us, which we intend to deliberate on, is the cannibalization and politicization of the public service the skewed appointments which we have noticed, and we regard the public service as the foundation of our nation. Nations begin to fail 